Hey sports fans, it's a beautiful evening in Fredericton and we're on the St. John River. We're going to be doing a night hunt for stripers and muskie. Let the games begin. Before we throw that bait out, we're going to put a little scent on her. We're going to start with the 10 inch Jake, the glitter perch. One of my favorites. And for you guys watching the channel, you might have noticed that we got the lip fixed. That's thanks to my buddy Mark Curry who had a spare one. Thank you very kindly, Mark. Good old striper went and shattered the last one. Gonna put a little herring scent on this. I'll be honest, I do think it helps, but you know the old saying, sometimes it catches more fishermen than fish. I like to at least think it can't hurt. And we're going to let out probably about uh, 70 feet to start. Seventy feet. Let's check our drag. Oh, the line clicker on. Tighten that up just a smidgen. There we go. Now we're all set. We're fishing. Whew, she's a tad warm. Thought it was safer to put the old wetsuit on in case we took a dip tonight. See the water temperature is right around 58 and a half degrees Fahrenheit. That's pretty cool. Better off to play her safe than sorry. At least you got a fighting chance with the gear on. Yep. Please folks, if you see some litter, pick it up. You sure would appreciate it. You know Mother Nature will. Wanna set up the old Jakenstein. That has been our go-to lore for the night bite. You guys probably saw last week Davy Boy, one of my oldest friends, he hooked into a couple stripers and man, oh man, was he ever happy. You know what? So was I. Awesome to see him fight those. Get this lanyard on. Got our nav lights on up above so we're safe. Got a couple lights in the front for the camera. Away we go. say that's an evening. Out for a couple hours and no hits, but we saw a ton of fish. I think we're going to try to get the kayak out a couple more times before the season ends. Love to hook onto one of those stripers and go for a Nantucket sleigh ride. Stay tuned. What an absolutely gorgeous afternoon. I'm going to start off trolling for some muskies up on this shallow flat and then I think we'll probably stick around this evening do a night hunt for some stripers. Time to check those lines. I don't see as much hay in the water today as I did for the last week or so. A little bit of weeds, but not too bad. Give us something to do when we're trolling. Making sure they're running clean. Looks like the clarity of the water has improved a lot as well. 
Water temperatures really dropped the last week. Was around high 50s, 58, 59. Now you can see she's down to 54. Getting cool. Time to head down river. Going to fish a couple spots, try that for about an hour or so. Hopefully find a hungry muskie. There's a big fish going. Down around about 15 feet. Right in the strike zone. We're on guys, we got a fish. We're on, that's a half decent size one too. Gotta get that motor off. That guy's got some weight to him. See if we can get him in here now. There he comes. Pulling good. Oh, did he just come off? No, he's still on. He's on. It's a nice muskie. We're in a good spot to get him. There he comes. Want to keep him down if we can. Trying to get around this way. in the bag. Oh my gosh, guys. How's that for a fish? Not too bad, eh? Okay, guys, that's a 45 incher right there. Beautiful, healthy specimen of a muskie. I'm gonna get the lines back out. Pretty awesome to see that hookup. We knew it was a half decent fish right from the get go. You could feel the weight. That was the old glitter perch that we got fixed up thanks to Mark Curry. Really appreciate that again, Mark. Looks like the bait's running good. All the hooks are looking good. Maybe we're into a feeding window, who knows. I always find muskier like that. Seem to put the feed bag on for an hour or two and then shut her off. Last spot of the day. 
Check this out for the next hour or so, see what happens. Another beautiful fall sunset in Friday. Doesn't get much better than that. Simply gorgeous. Let's call her a night. No action for the last hour, but we did manage to put a nice 45 inch muskie in the bag. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to hit the like button. It really helps out the channel. Till next time, stay safe.